John, I'd like to get your reaction to the possibility of Julian Assange being extradited to the U.S. from the U.K. I have not seen reporting on that, Jen, so I'd, I'd be loath to give you a position by the department on that. I, I, I don't have anything on that today. Okay. Um, let me move on to Ukraine and Russia. The Russian Foreign Ministry has called on the U.S. to rescind any offers to join NATO to uh, Ukraine and Georgia. Is that something that uh, the administration would agree to? Where do things stand on offers of membership in NATO for Ukraine and Georgia? Yeah, we, I mean, we've uh, talked to this. I think the secretary's spoken to this. I mean, obviously, um, NATO membership is is uh, is a NATO decision to make. Um, it, it's uh, the and Secretary General Stoltenberg has made it very clear that the the alliance makes those kinds of decisions. And the other thing you've heard President Biden say is that uh, it's up to individual sovereign countries to determine their own associations uh, and how. Uh, and to what degree they want to participate in associations. So uh, uh, this is this membership in NATO, regardless, is again for NATO allies to determine. But is it off the table if the Russian ministry has said that that thing, tensions will decrease if NATO membership is off the table for Ukraine? And Georgia, is that something that you would ever agree to? That's not uh, so. First of all, that again is not a Department of Defense call, uh, and that is again uh, sovereign nations decide that, and NATO allies are sovereign nations. Um, uh, so I, I don't have anything additional to offer on that today. And what are you seeing in terms of the buildup on the border since the president's call with Putin? I would say that uh, there still is a sizable amount of Russian forces uh, in the western part of their country around. The borders, uh, well, the border with Ukraine, uh, to the to the north, uh, to the east, and uh, to the south of what that that extreme eastern part of Ukraine. Has it changed? There, there have been. I I don't have uh, any major changes to speak to today, but we have continued to see increases over recent days and weeks. Sylvie. So we